put all your hands with my eyes to see. Straight buck wildin' in the place to be. If you really wanna party. Today is January 3rd. I did not record a video for the first of the year. I didn't record a video for Christmas. Only because like I was just trying to enjoy that time, you know, with my family and stuff. And I just didn't really feel like picking up a camera. So um, today I have to go to work and I'm gonna bring you guys with me along to go to work with me. Um, I've already made up in my mind that I'm about to be late. I literally have to be at work at seven in the morning and it's like 6.40 something and I'm still in my home. No. Hello. Thank you. And I'm uh, still here. So thank you. I'm like still in my um, area of where I live. And my job is literally like 40 minutes away. So right now I'm getting me some breakfast. I tried to go to Starbucks <laughs> and don't mind my voice. I'm not sure like what's going on. I'm not sure if it's like my sinuses or my allergies or whatever the case may be. I'm not sure what it is, but I got this drink from Starbucks and I'm so happy it was only $2 because Ooh, I would have been upset if it was more. So they were out of the medicine ball and I'm so upset because I've literally been wanting that, you know, for my throat or whatever. And they didn't have it. They didn't have the tea for it. So then she was like, well, I have another tea that we can use and we can still put the lemonade and something else in it. And I was like, yeah, we'll try that. Guys, this drink is nasty. Here you are. Thank you. Thank you. Check my bag. Yeah. The drink was disgusting. I can't even like drink it because it's so bitter. Like I really don't know how to understand how it is, but it's disgusting. Um, but yeah, I'm about to drive to work really quick and then I'm gonna just explain everything once I get there. But I just need to focus on driving and trying to make it to work on time because legit, I'm not gonna be there on time. Like it's about to be seven o'clock in like 15 minutes. So I literally need to get to going. But before we start this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and join the fam, folks. And let's get it. Okay, guys. So I made it to work. I was late, like I said I was going to be. So right now, I'm talking in the laundry room because I don't want nobody in the front to hear me. But I'm here by myself, you know, right now. I'm supposed to get here at 7 because the night audit leaves at 7. So usually, I come back here. This is the laundry room. I come back here. And I see if there's any type of laundry that I need to fold or wash or dry. Sometimes people bring down their linen to get swapped out for new ones. So it might be a load in there. But I forgot to tell y'all what I was. I'm sorry. So I got a new job, obviously. Um, I work as a front desk agent at a hotel. I'm not going to tell you what hotel, but yeah, I work as a front desk agent. And basically the first thing I do is I walk in and I clock in right there so you gotta hold your finger and you clock in and then the next thing I do is I sign a book um basically saying like what time I clock in and what time I clock out and stuff like that and so after that I come to the computer and um basically you gotta print out like all your departures for today so since I work in the morning 
my responsibility is to check people out and then when you come in from 3 to 11 that's when you check people in so the shifts are from 7 to 3 3 to 11 11 to 7 that's the only shifts that there is for hotels so I'm working um, 7 to 3 so I literally just have to make sure everybody is checked out at the checkout time our checkout time here is 12 p.m. so um, that's what time we check out um, here any other hotel I don't know and then um, the check-in time is at 3 so usually I sit in this little desk over here well not over here but I sit at this desk it's not my designated desk but I just sit there because like friend desk in the morning is really simple um, all we have to do is basically just keep up with the linen that's being put down here from the housekeepers and we wash dry fold and we place it right there after that we basically just make sure all of our departures is out um we can extend someone if they need to extend or sometimes we can even check in people early if we have that available but really my job is really simple and easy so today i'm just gonna be taking y'all along with me and i'm gonna try to film as much as i can i'm gonna just show you what i do and you know how everything has to go about it so let's go so i have quite a few um quite a good number of departures um but we only have three arrivals today which is not bad at all um, that means that only three people have made a reservation. So we have a lot more people leaving than we do have people coming in with reservations. Now, if that was switched, if we had like three departures and we had like 10 arrivals, like that would be an issue. But well, not really. But the idea is basically to have more rooms clean than the arrivals. I mean, then, yeah, than arrivals. Um, because anybody can like set for like a reservation so um i printed out all the papers that i needed to print out put it in a file and now i basically just sit here and wait for somebody to show up so i'm gonna sit here and edit and i'm gonna drink me some vitamin c because i drink these packets right here the emergency packets because something is wrong with my throat like yesterday i was having issues with my throat being scratchy and you know i was being congested right now i'm not congested but i'm just like my throat is scratchy like it just feels like something's there that's not moving and i bet you that it's mucus so i'm drinking that tea and i'm gonna drink the vitamin c and i'm probably start on my work but yeah i'll catch you guys later when something happens <laughs> i forgot i wanted to show y'all my little vision board that i created um huntington not trying to have me be great so I made a vision board last night and I think it turned out okay. Um, some of these goals I'm probably not going to be able to reach this year, but I just put anything, you know, apartment, a tattoo that I want, working out, definitely money. I am my type priority. I want to build a gym. So just different things that I have as says goals. So I'm going to be looking at this every day. So just something to look at just the update so all the departures are out sorry i didn't really record much a lot going on so all the departures are out and now it's time to check the trash because it's 1 30 and i leave at 3 so i'll be trying to do the trash early in enough time so let's go check it so the trash on both the second and third floor is not full so i'm not gonna take it out you want to take the trash out when it's full not when it's only like a little bit or like one or two things in there. So, yeah. Now, this is how much linen came downstairs from all the whole the housekeepers. So all it is, we gotta get washed and dry. And there's our washers, there's our dryer. We only have one dryer right now because the other one's broke. Lucky for me, there was only this trash that was there. Sorry that I'm out of breath, y'all. I don't take elevators, so I literally take the stairs. But yeah, this is the only bag, so I'll just leave the bin down there for them. But I'm not taking the trash out because it ain't mine, so I'm good. So now I am delivering these to certain guests in different rooms. So whoever is in these rooms, that's the 
room that I'm delivering this stuff to. Basically, just showing a small appreciation for our customers. They get like a little gift bag, different stuff in it. So, that's what I'm doing right now. So, good morning, everybody. It's definitely the next day. Um, so, I completely forgot to record for the rest of the day. Well, actually, no, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't forget, but guys, it was just so much going on. Like, after I saw that that laundry was like that, I had to be a team player and I had to step in and I had to help out with doing that laundry because that laundry was crazy, y'all saw. And so, um, right now, um, the night audit left me some laundry to do, so it looks like somebody brought their laundry to swap out. I got something in the dryer, I just took something out the washer and I put it all in these bins. So we have these bins where it's literally one for clean laundry and one for dirty. So all of this is clean. So I'm just gonna fold it right here on this table. And um, that's just what I'm gonna do. I have already printed out the departures for the day, the arrivals. Um, I've already done that on the computer. Um, I don't wanna show you guys because like, that has information, people's names that I don't wanna you know, put on the internet or whatever. So. I apologize for not recording for the rest of the day. It was just so much going on with everything, you know, with my job. It was just hard to pick up a camera. So I apologize for that. But I'm about to start working on this laundry right now. All of the laundry that I basically did. Um, the load that was in the washer is still in the washer. And then this load that's in the dryer is about to be done. I only had it on for 30 minutes. So um, I'm just going to take a break and I'm going to try to edit. So I am going to try to edit the video that you're looking at but that's what i'm about to do until everybody else gets here and then i guess when more people get here then i'll just start the second load as well because i can't leave it back there you know for a long period of time so i'll go ahead and start doing that so i just want y'all to see that y'all remember how cool it looked earlier this is how it looks now after the housekeeper takes the fresh linen and when they take it to go clean the rooms so literally when they can clean a couple rooms and they strip the beds and stuff they're literally gonna bring all the stuff out here because literally i have nothing now and in a short moment all of this stuff is gonna be full so just sit back and walk before i have to do so now i just got done walking the halls trying to figure out who is leaving at checkout time because it's now 12 22 but checkout was at 12. um mostly everybody extended today so nobody really checked out like that and you basically just walk the halls and you go to their rooms you knock on the door or ask if they're extending if they're there and then we can go into the rooms to see if they're actually there or not and then i'll just write down here because i have to make i have to take out all the departures in the system so that's what i'm about to do right now and i have to refund back the incidentals that we take um that we hold um when they first check in so that is what i'm getting ready to do right now literally we had all of these departures but most people extended like i said so yeah this is what i'm about to do
those two loads in there so now i'm just waiting for those to get done and i'm still doing some editing and this is all the notes that i wrote so far so i literally have to i rewrote all of this already so these this is the paper that i copied and then this is the new notebook that i'm using you can see so that's what i'm doing right now um and then i have my laptop here so yeah watching youtube and i was doing some editing so my video is actually like right here so the one that you're watching right now this is where it started all the way in the beginning so yeah guys i am basically off work now um now i'm about to get ready to go home because i'm tired you can hear it in my voice that i'm tired but thank you all for watching this small little i don't know if i want to call this a day in a life or if i want to call this a vlog for the past two days but um thank you guys for watching um make sure you guys join the fan phone and we are almost at 200 subscribers, so I am so excited. Thank y'all so much for supporting your girl. And I'm not going to talk any longer because I know y'all tired of me, but y'all have a good day.